three levels of fasting. Ah, yeah, three levels of fasting part two. And hi, how are you? We just did uh, our last video, and it's been a minute, and it did talk about three levels of fasting. Um, that was day one, three levels of fasting. It talks more about the waistline and um like if i have some viewers that are on here please leave them on here because i don't like chaos so if it's like some people that are like messing with me and i think they're messing with me please have them to stop messing with me thank you day one um of fasting so here we are um we moved from, um, I, I showed everybody, I was about a 124 when I made that video right there. Right now it's about a 121. And I'm moving up and down, up and down, trying to figure out something before I get down to waistline level. Here's where this is. Did I fail? No. Did I conquer any? Yes. A whole lot. So we're, we're going we're gonna to start right here. Um, we spoke on, and, and, and go further with part one, please, but we, we did speak on continuance with philosophy. Um, it's fasting levels below the waistline that is, um, it's called, it's uh, spoken higher for me, uh, trust and faithful levels of fasting. Um, at the waistline, it's like really below the waistline, okay? Um, it's an aggressive blood maintenance program for witnesses that want to approach ground zero levels and cannot hold on to their guts during their ecstasy states and their own fasting approaches. Meaning, if I eat a bowl of something um, and if I can't get my words right to uh, where it is um, that they want to approach me, I'm going to do it the best way that I can. How is that right now? We spoke on also, this is very important, the pendulum theory, it's a little bit new on how I'm speaking it, but it is um, uh, a pendulum theory of how to fast below the waistline um, where the left and the right side are equal in regards to gaining after you've done a large fasting and then how to ground it with another fasting. We call it a big fasting break. And it's not, it's not a feast, but it's a br big fasting break. Um, you should have already picked up some cash to do it again and again. If, and uh, most people are asking me, well, why would you pick up cash? Why don't you just continuously fast? Are you a fat ass? Then that's that with no cash. Okay. So, um, and then we'll go to the next one. Um, number one, when we speak about entity and attacks and approaches, we speak about black women first. And are there any black women around me when I'm fasting? Am I in an area where there's black women that congregate. Mostly, if they congregate, I'm able to, to pinch on to what's going on during the fasting. If they are in and out, it, it's, it's like ringing, 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 ringing um, of the doorbells that, yes, I'm around black folk in the city. So here's this. Um, drama, 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 ghost, link, Ken folk side. Your fasting is very fruitful. Now, if you feel to pick them up later, these are the same ones that pick up your uh, esqua uh, uh, jets and all that, and 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 they're the same ones that pick that up that have a feeling that you're working on something monumental. So, um, oh, how I lost my job. And that's another, it kind of goes hand in hand with the 124, and now it's 121. I want to show you this. Because it went a little higher than that. How I lost my job is that. 
kinfolk, ghost, kinfolk, ghost. And there's a lot of white women that are broad in waist. If they are showing me that they're tight and not as loose with their fat, then whoever is sexing them feels to loosen up and he can't. So if I'm dealing black women, that would be the black woman I'm talking about, regardless, regardless, regardless. If there's a person in, you know, like the area of, um, hey, gee, I just really want to get a burger, and I know that you're trying to respect your philosophy, then yes, that's at the job, like all day long. But the key is, if you hear this high, do you have all your information for your fasting, number one? Number two, is it real thick in there where they're trying to gain the information, too, in some kind of weird way of voodooism? If that's going on, then something about mine has to hold off. I'm getting ready to lose my job because I'm taking too much and I'm real resentful about it. So that's what happened. Um, the next one is the information connection or overload that wants to continue me in and out of that job and sometimes I have to say hold stop they're reaching below the waistline to do what you're doing and everything about you shows you're doing it. Your demeanor, your posture, um, it shows you're leading yourself, not so much others leading you. It shows that you're gathering too. It shows you are hefty with who you are. Now I'll continue on from here um, and I'll speak a little bit lighter. Every time that I'm, I'm gaining some more information about myself, I always understand that it's people that don't understand who I am. I'm very Illuminati sanctioned. I'm a ghost walk type of person. I am an angel of higher sources. And there's people around me that are claiming that a little higher and they are the law. If if everybody knows what the law is versus the law not, if, if I ever go into, you know, anybody else's thing, I, I, I want to try to tell you, they're the law, and they say I'm higher righteous. And when they do it, they understand they're, they're, they're like maybe older and don't know how to do the same thing that the others are doing. But we know we're striving. I may lose my, my mom for this. This is weird shit here. The attack always is on black women first. Then it's on older black women. Then it's on black men. Then it's on the other classes. And I'm not the one to, to congregate that. I'm one that knows how to shade myself where you wouldn't know either or because it's my skin philosophy, hair, nails, and teeth, including my bone, that know how to integrate enough to figure out why the serpent didn't want us to know he was in the garden in the first fucking place. Oh, I want to do it. I want to do it. I want to do it. There is a, um, there's a way for me to understand. Now, I am actually gathering some food. I think I spoke enough on this. Did I speak enough on this? We understand about uh, most of that. Okay, so we can go a little further. Here's where I am. All right. Huh? Um, and if you're in a fasting way, I wouldn't mind comments, and I'm a little slow with that. And as you can see, I am waistline ready. It's already thinned uh, the walls for me to continue on. Uh, my menstrual, my ketones are very, are very high. 
Uh, so I'm in a fasting state right now. Um, and um, it's been pretty steady. So I am um, calling my day a payday. I am um, out of a job right now, and it did throw me out, like really forcefully. It, it wasn't pretty. And now it's very intrusive with unemployment and uh, any kind of food cards. It's very intrusive, meaning it's a mother or an aunt or a employer that knows that she's like a relative that is intruding with my, substan my substantial something to arrive me at a place of payday and the food card is only arriving me to food which is hefty for the program that we're talking about uh, we talked about the pendulum theory um, where you know you eat all you can eat and then you do your fasting again and you're at a weight where you just kind of doing it right below the waistline and that's the healthiest way to do that and you do need some money for that now the fasting helps you with that and I'll go a little further if there's an attack on you and I say um, um, and I know I'm at a, a, a weight that I, I am 120. I am going to be a little selfish. I'm at 121. I want to indulge a bit um, uh, with my own. I'm at 121, and it seems as if, um, you know, I have five days. And then it, it seems like my metabolism's right there at the two, the two, the two, the two. Um, pounds. Okay, so I'm not that far off from the waistline. That's what my, my, my main goal is to have you to focus in on the pounds down to the waistline is safer to play this game. <clears throat> so how far am I down to the waistline? Then as I'm fasting, am I a white person or am I a black woman around some black folk? Um, 121, <clears throat> no, I'll just go to 120, yeah, in a, in a few hours, probably be 120, but right now we're at 121, and then we'll, we, we say in about 10 days, we're at the waistline now, okay, so, and we have one break in the middle of those five days each, okay, uh, in the middle of those 10 days, so we, we, we have one small break, and I've chosen, um, tuna, a can in water, okay, and a Dorito, and I did the like the generic ones. Yes, okay, and and, and your favorite kind of show. I'm choosing shows like back from the '60s and shit, and like comedy ones that get your Buddha up. That gets me rising. So we say tuna in water, one of those little ounce cans, a few ounces there, and um, a bag of the generic uh, Tito's with the season. Okay, and then um, and then I have my little Hawaiian, some kind of punch cocktail that's that's like right there, and I take a little syrup or that, and that should do me well for the next five days. I've been doing that, and that's been working. Okay, um, but. Mind you, above the waistline, and if you're very Reiki oriented, meaning are you extremely feel of the environment, honey? I ain't talking about cold chills and his ringing of the of the spine. Okay, so when uh, you go to the to the to the to the to the scale, please trust it for now. But it does show two, two, two when you're off of everything. Okay, so okay, so it's a good judge that way. It's not a good judge if you take a sip of Diet Coke, like a tablespoon. It almost like it beats you to the scale. Two ounces, honey. So something's thick. <laughs> some, some odd stuff. Now, um, I'm just trying to show you what this is. Now, and this is when, when you got people in the house here. Um, 
And then if you're like speak oriented, like with 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 it, with sword word or with, with word is sword, but if you're like speak sword and the shit's still kicking, then you know it's real thick. So we're going to have to bear witness that this is where it is now. And if you hear now, you you understand I have to take action. Do they understand it? No. Okay. So, um, yeah, I've overloaded me with that. Oh, yeah. So, my waistline, and then I, I'm, I'm gaining some momentum on... And, and in the last video, we were talking about some vegetables and what tones to eat during your break, if you feel for that. Um, I did head witness. I'm, I'm a little bit more vibrant to take tuna in the water, but something light is what we're talking about. And the sips are really good if you can handle that. It shouldn't turn into a gulping. You understand that to be an issue, the licking and the gulping. Okay, so when... Um, in other words, become polite and understand where you're at and understand where that cup is. And is it a one-fourth or is it like, like you know, is it like a, a, a gulp of three-fourths of whatever that is? And it should be like one-fourth going to a half and I should be polite about putting it up because something obviously wants me to, to do weirdness with the thickness Now you understand that with the weight, you feel to, to kind of head weigh it down um, with ones of eth ethnic, um, uh, like women. And also, if you have that in there, it should be no difference. Now you hear me. It's a black issue now. We got diabetes in our fams. Grand. Where are we now? Okay, now, there's an Institute of Living and Learning. Does everybody understand where we are with, with fasting, the break? Well, well, let's go into definitions here. If we're below the waistline, and we're not at the 200 and the 800 and all that. We're at the waistline now, and we continue to do our fasting. Remember that some people are, are able to understand that God's witness is having me to go to somewhere to pull money out of like a machine, and it rolls. We call it the ATM. Did you go to your ATM? Did it roll the pins? No. And you're at 120 hearing the information. I believe that some people that are really overweight hear it higher to do that in their Buddha call and have a lot of weight to take off. So they have extra money to play that online game uh, with videos and, you know, and, and with uh, dance choreography and uh, sunscreen at the beach. They have that you know, at their, and we're speaking on ones that are a little younger, youthful, not, but younger, um, in their, in, in the ways that they are, and the way that they kept their weight off, so we're looking at waistline fasting. Pendulum theory, theorem, philosophies, Pendulum, the pendulum, the pendulum. Left, right. Left, right. Now, why am I fasting? Does that ever come up with a lot of black folk? So here's what we're going to do. Why am I fasting? And they can't, like, understand it to be different than 200. But yeah, they do. So why am I fasting? to gain witness at the ATM to get the cash rolling. Now, if you understand what I'm saying, most white people will understand what ATM is. You got a casino around the fucking corner. Did you take a dollar and hit the fucking slot? This is a white person's game. The million dollar game. 
are you clean enough in your gut? Most of the time, black folk want to hear that. No, are you clean at all to get in front of the ATM, look it in its something, does it look back at you, and does it see that you're brighter than the one that didn't have that going on with the luck of a draw spell of goo? Ah, okay. So, we understand that we have to be a certain manner in front of the one that hands it to us the most, which is ourselves in that bright manner we would only want to see um, in front of our face anyway. Uh, so, yeah. Every week is what I support. Um, as you start gaining money, everybody knows how to gain money online to start that protocol. All right. Everybody knows that if they're at the levels of here, they are able to play the psychic thing for a little bit if they want to. If you feel to give someone a reading, it does hurt the fuck out of people if it's too deep of a reading. At this level, it's deeper than anything, but can be very calm down to a donation of small. Um, and that supports the uh, winding of the bells at the ATM, and uh, also the ones that support you during that mission, and if they understand exactly what you're going through, it supports them and their mission if they do feel to pick up on it. I'm very keen that there's some people witnessing me like that, um, and they have not supported me. So we are uh, arriving at a time that we understand that we're here, that we're now, that the time is now, that our fasting is now, that our prayerfulness is now, and we should have already been prayed up. All right? And our belt buckle is sealed. All right? And our feet is interlocked with the one that we arrive as our, our uh, arrive as our star soul journey member. There should be a twinship about you and him at a rate that you look really nice together and there's no difference in you and you're able to take care of each other's needs at the spot. There's nobody that knows how to do that for you except for you. Um, okay. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I thought that the video wasn't running. Okay, I'm okay. Now, I'm getting ready to, um, yeah, um, I'm getting ready to, um, tell you. I've had a really weird time with people, and I have a lot of thickness. So, if you guys want to play mind games with me, we can. And there's a little bit, and I'm, I'm hating to do philosophies, um, on screen like this, but there's been um, one issue, and if we solve it together, you understand how I brain solve uh, some of these issues here to see if I need to go a little harder with it or just ignore the call to go harder with it. Um, um, if it's more, it's it's a black thing going on, or if it's uh, more understanding, and I could, I could deal with philosophy a little bit later, then you feel to hold that in your gut and suffer it. Um, that's the only thing I can suggest. But other than that, you do know how to play a game when it comes to your fast. Your breaking moment with the heat and wind um, vor, uh, uh, conjecture of energies that kind of swindle together is always at the waistline. It ain't never b above it, and it may be shown to you a little bit from ones that may have skimped there for a second. Um, it's, 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 it's like cold heat, or uh, that's all I can, I can say. Okay, so when that's happening for you, that's at the waist level. But for you on... Um, that understand that there's people that want to really hear the message and they're around you and they're like real tight on you and they're like interfering in a mode where they call it their space. Here's where this is. A small piece of candy and some, a little bit of Diet Coke should not hurt anyone's feelings. It should kind of clear your head a little bit like an aspirin. All right. 
And do you know how to do that? My thing is when I do that, I note it a little bit on where I am now. All right. And then I understand that they're real slow in the house. Um, the sound is slow to pick you back up on your 222 to get you where you need to go. So if they know how to do that, they know how to do it a little bit, but not a full force of it. If they're still intruding in the space they least want to be intruded on, especially if they were at their own mama's house and the mama is taking care of something for them, it is their worst enemy that would come in and say this now, but you have no issue with me, so be gone issue. Philippians 2, 4, there is someone in my fucking business. You are no matter of mine and no matter of theirs either. And this is the thing that would get black people like in and out, in and out. But if you're seeing yourself having to do it an hour later, that ain't that. You see yourself doing it the next day. That's that. Okay, and then if it's been 24 hours, my thing is always, okay, let it be 48 hours before, and I'll play a game like that until it ain't shit, <laughs> until I do it on my five. Okay, so you, you hear that hot. That's very smart if they're very witness to what I'm doing, though. Then it's very smart to do it the way I just told you. I just took 24 hours, and I make a little dot next to my shit, saying that that happened and then are they going to do it again within the next within the next within the next I shouldn't even bring this back up to see if I need to do it again but I'm being threatened every other hour where my mind's partner is saying to do it every hour anyway then that threatens me that he's not all right and I need to get him better my mind tricks me to not say that I need to be on that faster because it'll only go in two pounds a day that should actually be enough to spark anyone's interest to start doing it. And as I speak about witness, my partner is a witness too. So, and I, I hate to say it like that, but yes. Okay. Now, um. So yeah, it's it's real wise to do your five. It's real wise to know how to do that and if they're um, if, if they're real showbiz on screen for a while then um, they're jumping to see if they can see you but in the long run they're really jumping to, to scold you um, for notifying you know any member of the family that he's able to come in and out of your dreams and stuff He's worse than the most, and the most of the most. So it's like, I don't want you to have your job. I don't want you to have that substance cash. I don't want you to have anything that will help you. I'll scound your mom if she gives you any extra. He's witness to that type of behavior, and his behavior comes out like that if he tries to see who I am that is able to carry a conversation like this, and no one's able to give her anything. But we've already went over that. In the last CD, in the last taking, we went over that. All right, I grounded my cash for me to arrive at it at another location. Namaste. <laughs>